The pressure treatment process begins with untreated wood products being transferred into the treatment cylinder. Once the wood is inside the treating cylinder, the door is closed and sealed, and a computerized process control system starts the pressure treatment process. The first step in the treatment process begins when a vacuum pump removes the air from the treating cylinder. When the vacuum step is complete, the next step of the process is transferring the treatment solution from a storage tank into the cylinder. The treatment solution consists of water and preservatives that are designed to help protect the wood from fungal decay and termite attack. Additional treatment additives, such as color pigments or water repellents, can be added to the treating solution. Another type of treatment available will produce wood products that are fire retardant. Once the cylinder is completely full with the treatment solution, the next step is to pressurize the cylinder using a pressure pump. The increased pressure in the cylinder forces the treatment solution into the wood. When the pressure cycle is complete, the next step is to transfer the remaining treatment solution back into a storage tank. The final step in the pressure treatment cycle is to initiate a final vacuum. Once the final vacuum cycle step is complete, the cylinder door is opened and the pressure treated wood is removed from the treatment cylinder and the process is finished. Following treatment, samples of treated wood are tested for proper preservative penetration and retention.